as a destination, as a country, there are so many things. It depends on you know what what you really enjoy. Uh, Maldives for divers, it's it's a paradise. You know, most people wouldn't be able to enjoy the clear visibility of Maldives. So divers, they like it. So if you ask a diver, they will say, for diving, Maldives is the best place. But then we have now you know big game adventurers who wants to swim with whale sharks. For them, it's uh, you know, swimming and sailing with the manta rays, with the whale shark. But for honeymooners, which Maldives is predominantly known as, it's a relaxation uh, destination where you just go and just, you know, the art of doing nothing. Now Maldives is known as a family destination. There are so many products, new resorts that are coming, specially orientated towards families. So now we have that segment um, that's, that's been becoming very popular. And the, one of the recent trends that we have seen is Maldives becoming very popular for people to go for anniversaries. We just had a you know, Silicon Valley company you know, hiring a whole resort just to have fun for anniversary with the staff, to engage with the staff and for bonding. Again, something totally new. So it depends on you know, what the person that you're asking and what you are looking for. We have an island resort or product for everyone. Just yesterday, um, we had the world's first underwater hotel for someone who wants to you know, stay in a hotel resort, which is underwater. The European market is still our biggest market. 55% of our whole inbound tourists are from Europe. But if you really look at Far East and the Asia and the continental Europe, it's 45%. So the rest of the world is 45%. So the reason why we do well across the board is because the products and the things that we offer in the resort. So we don't need to specially gear towards a specialist market, but we are able to cater that. For any tourist destination, it's, it's always a challenge, especially for a country like Maldives, who has been the, you know, the number one destination in the world. When it comes to high end, Maldives has been the number one. And for us to stay in the number one position, it's very hard. Over tourism, I don't think it's going to be a problem, especially the way Maldives operates. Each resort or island is one island, one resort. So at any given time, time, depending on the resort that you are going, you will have 100, 250 or 200 people at most, you know, customers. And we have 135 resorts at the moment. So even if we open 100 new resorts, you will have the same experience, you will have the same privacy. It's because of the islands we have. From north to south, Maldives is bigger than United Kingdom, and we have over 1,200 islands.